Hello future engineers, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you like what I'm doing, please don't forget to share my videos to your friends and to your friends' friends. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. Plot the combined shears at 2 meter intervals in a 16 meter long beam supporting a dead load of 6 kN per meter and a uniform live load of 20 kN per meter. So let us generalize the situation. Because the live load is moving, this would be the position of the left end of the live load at distance x from the left support. So we'll solve for RA and derive for shear at distance x from the left support. So summation moment about B equals 0, RA times 16 equals 6 times 16 times 8 then plus 20 times 16 minus x times 16 minus x over 2. 20 times 16 minus x times 16 minus x over 2. So Ra is equal to 48 plus 5 over 8 times quantity 16 minus x square. Therefore, the shear at section x is Ra minus 6x. So shear at section x equals Ra minus 6x, substituting the value of Ra 48 plus 5 eighths of 16 minus x quantity square minus 6x, and tabulating the results using your calculator mode table. So before plotting, let's have x in meters and shear at distance x in kilonewtons. When x is 2, substitute here. When x is 0, substitute here. So shear is 48, 208 rather, when x is 0. When x is 2 meters, substitute here. Shear is 158.5. When x is 4, here, x is 114, 6, 74.5 kilonewtons, 8, 40 kilonewtons, 10, 10.5 kilonewtons, 12, when x is 12 meters, negative 14 kilonewtons. When x is 14, shear is negative 33.5 kilonewtons. And when x is 16, x is negative 48, as shown, which is the reaction here, 48. So let's now plot. So 208, then it reduces to 158.5. That should be the slope, uh, negative decreasing, then 114, then 74.5 when x is 840, when x is 10, 10.5, when x is 12, negative 14 kilonewtons, when x is 14, negative 33.5, and when x is 16, negative 48 kilonewtons. So that's the variation of the shear at distance x.